Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Kyle Austin, I'm ex 22 and today I'm going to be showing you guys the, how to get the Bugatti Veyron, I believe that is the name of it, also known as the Adder in GTA 5. Now, I just want to make something clear to you guys that I'm sorry I haven't been posting in about a month. Uh, it's just, I got started with school and stuff, I haven't really had the mood to make videos, and I was just, you know, getting ready, like, getting all my stuff ready for school and everything, but, uh, this is how you get the Bugatti Veyron. Now, I'm just showing you guys right now how much it actually costs. Um, I'm going to show you guys the location. It mostly spawns there, like 90% of the time. Uh, so you can see right there, it's called the Adder. It's a million dollars. And uh, actually, guys, you can actually, um, uh, in the same spot uh, where I'm showing you guys where the Bugatti is, you can also get a Lamborghini. Uh, so say if the Bugatti's not there, a Lambo would spawn there as well, but normally you guys would find Lambos everywhere. Uh, a trick I found for finding Lambos, if you go to the parkway uh, along the beach side, as you guys can see to the left of the mini-map, um, then if you just drive around the parkway, you'll eventually see one. It's probably the easiest one, because I remember I drove the whole parkway, and I found um, a, whatever, uh, a, Bug uh, a Lambo. So if you guys go to that location, I just marked on the mini mini map, uh, right over here. Uh, this is where the Bugatti is located, and it's it's actually if you're at Michael's house and you just go right down the road, uh, if you just go at, if you go from Michael's house, you make a left and just keep going down, uh, and then you'll see uh the Bugatti. Uh, well, you go to that street and then you'll see the Bugatti uh, there. And, uh, yeah, it does come in different colors and stuff, as you guys can see, I'm picking the locker right now. And I'm gonna drive over to a, uh, Los Santos Customs and, you know, customize my car. And, uh, just let you know, guys, GTA 5, I recommend this to everybody who, uh, wants to buy GTA 5. It's probably gonna, it's probably one of the most funnest game of the year, I'm telling you that. Uh, I'm almost completed with it, actually. Uh, I'm at... The mission where uh, I really don't want to spoil it for you guys, but um, I'll just say I'm like about I only have like 20 missions left, so it's not that much. It's 65, I believe. No, oh, 69 actual missions. I'll, I'll tell you what mission I'm on actually right now. So I'm at uh, what? Yeah, I'm at. 45 out of 69 missions. So, uh, yeah, this is some of the customizations. Here's the armor upgrade. Uh, I have everything unlocked, so I'm gonna put the best customizations on here, and I have a decent amount of money. So, yeah, I got that, and I got um, engine level four. Uh, we got really nice horn. Uh, probably, yeah, I'm gonna place that. I'm not sure which one I'm gonna use. Uh, by the way, I pre-recorded this. It's not a live commentary, by the way. Um, yeah, of course it's not. So, you're gonna put the blue lights on because it looks swaggy. You know, swaggy swag. I don't know what I'm talking about. But, yeah, we're gonna put black on blue. And then we're gonna make it, you know, chrome maybe. Maybe we're gonna make it chrome, I'm not sure. But, yeah, and there's some really cool colors for the Bugatti. And I'm not, I don't really remember. I'm pretty sure I make it purple. Yeah, and then I make it a different color. But, uh, there's some pretty cool customizations on this game. I'm pretty sure I'd do that purple and chrome, yeah. And I, I really like the color design uh, and stuff and the customization on here a lot. Uh, do race transmission, turbo t tuning, uh, just making this the best possible car you can get or customization for the Bugatti. Uh, so we're gonna put good wheels. I really like um, carbon shadow wheels. They're probably one of my favorite wheels. I don't, th I don't think I put them on. No, but uh, yeah, those are probably my favorites. They're probably one of the best ones. I, I like the look of it on the Bugatti if you change the color up a little bit, but you can change the wheel color and uh, you can also get like a uh, limo, uh, like limo windows and stuff like that, so that's, that's pretty sick. And uh, you know, I actually change the accessories. You can get bulletproof tires, custom tires, only if you can write your actual name on it or write something that would look really, really sick. But you know, you can do all that other stuff. Um, you can also get tire smoke, which basically. Uh, changes the color of when you skid and stuff. I actually show it uh, upcoming in a second. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty sure I don't even know what tire smoke. I think I did blue tire smoke. But as you can see, if you hit the bright bumpers in the back, you can actually see the tire smoke. 
And I try to get to a better view, but yeah, there's blue tires, but it looks really, really awesome. So, uh, yeah, that, that's basically it, guys. That's how you get the Bugatti Veyron. Uh, if you need to switch back to the video, uh, like, I, I probably didn't show the map thoroughly well, but yeah, that, that's basically how you get it. I'm going to be giving you guys more tutorials. I'm actually going to, I'm starting to record one right now, and I'm going to show you guys how to get uh, into the army base without any stars that I kind of found a little trick. So yeah, that's it guys. Hope you guys enjoyed and see ya.